Hey guys, so today I want to show off a new feature here or a little flex here or change that Apple seems to have done in iOS 8 beta 2. Now this might not be a thing that they've changed but I think it is because I have an iPhone here, my iPhone 5 on the right side with iOS 8 beta 1 and then I do have my beta 2 here on my iPhone 5s on the left side. So basically this has to do with spotlight. It seems like now when you search for something and you exit out of spotlight and then you go back uh, it will highlight the text so you easier will be able to be able to start to type a new query or maybe some new text to search for something new instead of being having to select the text or just to click on the delete button so let's just uh, check it out here pretty quick so basically what you do here is you swipe down like this and you can see I have search for something on both and you can see that uh, here in iOS 8 beta 2 it, it have already highlighted the text uh, versus the um, beta 1 uh, which hasn't done that uh, and you can uh, see here of course this new one of the big new additions with iOS 8 uh, beta uh, or with iOS 8 in general was that uh, you now be able to search for a ton more things in the spotlight like movies, music, uh, directions to places and, and such so you can see um, if you just go back again you can see it does it all the time so let's also check out the version here that we're running on. So if we would just type something new, let's say Angry Birds here, quick type. There we go. We do that one more time. And you can see it's already selected it. So pretty nice. I like it a lot. See if it works if we go like this. Yeah. So I like that feature. If you know any other new cool feature inside of iOS 8 beta 2, definitely let me know about that. Or if you want to see a specific video, also let me know about that. And hopefully you did enjoy this video. Peace out.